a rustic skillet pot pie, vegan, low sodium pie crust. Okay, so we're going to start with our pie crust, and we're going to have five to six tablespoons of ice cold water and a tablespoon of apple cider vinegar. I have one and a half cups flour, and to that I'm going to add a stick of vegan butter. I'm going to do the country crack, and then we're just going to use a pastry cutter or fork and kind of like work it in until it's like little pea sizes, right? And then we're going to slowly start adding our liquid. You might not add all the liquid. You might add a tiny bit more of the liquid, but you want it to just come together. You don't want it to be a wet dough. That's why we do just a little bit at a time. And then we're going to pour it out onto some, I have some saran wrap, as you see already below my bowl. Just pour it out on there. And I'm going to use the saran wrap, right, to like, what? watch, watch, watch it go down. <laughs> we're just going to work it in and smoosh and work it in and smoosh that we don't make like a whole mess. And you're just going to make it into like a, like a baller disc. You know what I mean? Look at, look, a disc. I did a disc. And <laughs> we're going to put it in the fridge and let that get colder. Now we can go wild with the vegetables. You can do whatever you want. I meant to put broccoli. I forgot. But I have a couple um, celeries, a couple carrots, a red potato, sweet potato, an onion, and a little EVOO. We're just going to saute these down a bit. Then we're going to add a little couple tablespoons of cornstarch, depending on how thick you like it. I did too. If you want it thicker, add a little bit more. Some parsley, black pepper, garlic powder, onion powder, and mix that up. And then we're going to add a cup of vegetable broth. Start stirring that together. And then two cups of my homemade vegan oat milk. Should we watch? <laughs> She laid me for rest with the white slip skirt Burning with an angel that was caught in the surf The breath of my heart started with the with of a touch in the surf I died at first on my earth, submerged in the love divers Ooh, goodnight kisses, while he wishes and reminisces His eyes kissing while he waits for the full moon above Oh, ivory dove, passionate love Listening closely, positioning my intuition for her nutrition And ambition, nutrition and ambition, get up Like when you rise in the morning, rub your eyes in the morning through the skies in the morning, get up like when you rise in the morning, rub your eyes in the morning through the skies in the morning, get up, hey. Don't forget to use code Midnight Munchies for 10% off yours linked below. So we're going to boil that to a simmer. And then while that's going, we're going to roll out our pie crust between two pieces of parchment paper because it's way easier. Then we're going to put it back in the fridge. It's very important to keep it super cold because that's going to help give it a little flaky layer. So then we're going to put that on top and we're ready to put it in the oven. And listen, I'm not going to crimp the edges or anything. I'm just going to let it hang over all rustic because I'm just going to eat the extra pie to crust because it's delicious. And then I'm going to vent it a little bit and I don't know, let it bake at 425 for, I don't know, Know, about half an hour until your pie crust is done and oh my god you guys you gotta have to let it cool longer than I did because now it's even more soupier <laughs> I'm gonna get a bite I really wish I remembered the damn broccoli and it's yes uh flavor is amazing and this pie crust hold on uh, let me get a little flavor of just the pie crust by itself can I just tell you without the salt that apple cider vinegar I can't figure out what exactly it tastes like but it gives it a little something extra so full written recipe a link below Ooh. midnight subscribe.